Well, I am back in Missouri. I ended up coming back to Crane Creek. Um, see how this goes again. I uh, had a good time last time we were here. So, but I thought I'd run down here for a quick trip and see if we can get a little bit more production out of this. Um, gonna fish in a little bit different spot this morning and this afternoon we'll probably head back to uh, the southern portion and fish that again. So, but uh, beautiful day. So we'll see, see how things go this time. So this is Crane Creek. I walked a ways down and came over to cut into jump into the creek and there was no creek so I was trying to figure out what was going on what happened to my creek and I don't know I don't know if it goes underground we've got like a little trickle here um, but then I had moved up a little bit further and I saw that the creek was there but it looks like it must go underground or something. So if anybody lives in the area or knows Crane Creek, I guess let me, uh, let me know what this is about. But now we're back to the creek. So I don't know, interesting. Yeah, it's got to flow all the way up to there and then it's gone for like, I don't know, that's probably another half mile down. <laughs> Walked in and there was no creek. So, all right, well, that's something, but here's some water. So I guess we'll fish this. Wow, there's just, look at how big some of those are. Holy cow. There are some big ones in there. Wow. That is just crazy. There's some easy 15 inches in there. No way I'm catching any of them, but. Yeah, there's Dano. Yeah, holy cow, those are some big fish in there though. Jeez, yep, yeah, they're just pooled deep. Well, they're not going to do much. Wow, there's some in there that are at least 15 inches. Holy smokes. There we go. Oh, that's a nice one too. So we're really worried about that tippet. Let's go, buddy. Oh yeah, that is a nice one. Oh my gosh. Nice. Look at the colors on this guy. Oh, look at you. Yep. Wow, he's a good 14 inches. Holy smokes, look at the color on you too. guy oh my gosh get the colors on him hey bud
Ah, wow. Little one came out and <laughs> hit that. Jeez. Came, came hard for that, didn't you, buddy? It's a little one. So, Crane Creek, a little slow today. Well, we ended up catching two. One was that super nice 14 plus inch McLeod rainbow. So that thing was a very pretty fish and I'm pretty happy with that one. But overall it was pretty slow. Uh, the fish are kind of stacked up in the deep holes, not really doing much. I think they're all getting ready for winter. So, but we might, we might have to come back here sometime in uh, this next spring and see how they, see how it is then. So um, we'll see, I'm probably gonna be in Nebraska next time around so we'll see what we can do there might head out west for a little bit so anyway still uh day fishing is better <laughs> better than day working so talk to you later